if you still get stuck with missing file error in 3D Max, so you are not familiar with the Relink bitmap script yet. Welcome to Mimviz. Well guys, we already learned how to fix missing files error and how to save time. The solution is simple. Instead of using configure project path or asset tracking to define a new path, The best way is to use the Relink bitmap script. The advantage of using this script is that we no longer need to enter a new path every time. And we can define a parent folder for it to be stored forever in Relink bitmap memory and automatically search for our textures and files in that path. We introduced it earlier in a video and explained how to install it. If you haven't seen it yet, check it out. This script has settings and options that we will cover in this video. Well, we got acquainted with the safe path directory section and the main sections, but now we come to the options. Well, try enabling the search subfolder option permanently because it searches all subfolders. For times when you don't know exactly which folder your file is in, or a series of frequently used folders that you always want to be searched. It is very convenient and increases your speed. The next option is ignore case. If enabled, uppercase and lowercase letters do not affect the search process. Ignore extension also ignores the file format type in the search. When you have a large scene with many textures and your system does not have enough RAM, it is better to activate the allow memory option. The search max file pass option also performs the search process in the path where the 3D max file is saved. But let's go to the missing bitmaps window. In this window, click on any texture and press the find button. All materials used in that texture are displayed in the material editor window. But be sure to set the material editor window to compact before that. Now in the material editor window, we can find the object used by this material and we can modify it if we want. But the missing path strip option changes the path from absolute to relative. And this means that if our texture is next to our 3D max file, it will find it. Delete all missing bitmap also removes all missing textures from our material. Guys, this script increases the speed of work a lot. When I use ready-made models, I first import everything into the 3D Max scene, and then I introduce the textures to them with this script. So I suggest you definitely use it, because this script claims to have saved 279 years of the artist's time. Also, this script is free. Thank you for being with us. Follow our next tutorials.